Hello everybody, my name is Shufa and welcome to Lurking Darkness. It's an indie horror game about four people that went missing and we're supposed to find them. Enter the woods. September 14th, 1990. Four friends would enter the Greek clock woods for an overnight camping trip. Two days later, they were reported missing. A search party was quickly put together. As part of this party, your goal is to find any survivors within the woods. Or what's left of them. Okay, so this will be easy. Shut your stupid Looks like I don't have a whole lot of time before it gets dark. With some luck, maybe I can find the campsite and go from there. Sounds good. So we got trail... Trail F and... Trail F entrance. I get a Halloween feeling from this. Oh, it's early in the morning right now and we might just be in some trouble after barely even one night. We heard something outside our tents last night. Maybe a bear or something. Whatever the case, they went away after around 10 minutes. For some reason though, Danny was super freaked out and he really wanted to get out of here. Stu fought with him over leaving because it took us a month to organize this camping trip. And then he eventually calmed down. But then we woke up this morning and then he's gone. So is our truck. We were miles from their village. But luckily there are park rangers around here. So we'll go looking for them soon. Alex also overpacked so we have a ton of supplies. I mean who needs two axes? Okay so that was some lore. Let's go. I think this is the campsite. The campsite. It's been deserted. Why would they leave? Maybe they're further down the trail. At least, I hope so. Okay, there one more note. It's sundown at this point and it's just Stu and I left. We managed to barricade the hole in the chain link fence with some fallen logs. But I don't think it matters. Alex took off towards the cries we heard in the distance. Wait, I just realized, look there's some capital letters, D, A, I think they're trying to communicate, let me write them down, D, A, maybe dead. Let's go back to the start of the page, Alex took off towards the cries we heard in the distance on the other side of the woods. With one of our axes, he said he was going to find someone and get, a, and get us out of here. It's been nearly three hours. We haven't seen him since. Only heard his screams. All we have to defend ourselves is an axe. But the voices moved too fast to even know which direction to swing at. We decided to lock up the axe in the lockbox we brought. We hid it in the hopes that it won't find it and make anyone else suffer even more than we have. We don't have much time left before it gets dark. Okay, so right now it spells out the word dark and starts searching for us. We just have to accept that we will never be seen again. Okay, so there seems to be some kind of ghost or something. Multiple voices and shit. Okay, so there's a code thingy. Let's try the uh, combination we got, which is uh, dark. Oh. Let's go. Okay, let's see if they're in these woods or completely lost. I say we follow this trail. Okay. And we have to have eyes out for any more notes and stuff. The hole in the fence has been barricaded. Maybe I can find some thing to help get these logs out of the way. Ranger station ahead. They said they barricaded it. But let's get this down. Good. Ain't no way, bro. What do you mean it's broken? Are you serious right now? Weak ass axe. Oh, 
Oh, it's getting dark. It was a bloodbath. It came back to the campsite and tore Stu apart. And I just ran. I kept running and running, but I think I'm lost and I'm going in circles. I ran past the reindeer station, but it was totally deserted. I'm so scared it's still haunting me. It just wants us to suffer, to play with us. What will happen to me? It ripped Stu's head clean off, tore off his limbs. Is that what's going to happen to Alex? It can't end this way. Oh no. I wonder what this monster's look. No, 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 no. I just heard fucking footsteps. Maybe it was my own footsteps. I think it was false. Yeah. Hello? Nobody's here. Where did a park ranger go? Yeah, he's dead. So we got a padlock here. Read log. September 15th, 02. Heard cries for help off in the distance and my partner hasn't shown up yet. I have no clue what to do since I haven't even had his job for a night yet. I guess I'll go look for who's crying, but I'm definitely not made for this. Gate key. Okay, so let's open this gate. Of course it starts raining. A note. I don't want to die, I don't want to die, I don't want to die. Chat, I don't think he wants to die. Okay, I think I saw something. I swear I'm paranoid. There's some bad spirits here. Oh my. There. I think I'm going to be sick. I don't understand. Who would do this? Something is very, very wrong. I need to get back to my car right now. It's not good when that pops up. I'm not sure what happened to the siren head. Who keeps breaking them lights? They're not cheap. Oh. What was that? Goofers. I guess we have to break his ankles. Okay, run. You're never gonna catch me. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die. What? Don't look back. No, thank you. Chat, I think it's safe. Oh shit. Okay, I think we're safe.
Okay, so I'm not sure what kind of monster that was, but maybe we weren't supposed to know. But I was lurking darkness. Thanks for watching. Bye.